Hey, how's it going guys? Yesterday I talked about a GameStop sale that was pretty good in the tax day sale. Now the one notable deal is the buy five pre-owned PlayStation 4 games get 50% off. And uh, yeah, I went through the sale today and I spent about an hour digging up every game under the price of $20 that I thought was a pretty decent purchase. And what I noticed is this sale is pretty freaking great. Uh, if you buy five or more games, you can end up getting some really good deals as you can already see what's on the screen. We're just going to go through everything. Games stop limits you to 50 items a cart there were a couple more outside of the 50 that are in my cart right now that i thought were pretty good i'll leave links for those in the description box below one thing I do want to note, as far as getting a case and manual with your GameStop purchase, uh, that's a little bit of a crapshoot at times. In my experience, PlayStation 4 games and PlayStation 5 games, of course, usually you get case and manuals with those. When I ordered a bunch of 3DS games, uh, that was a little bit more of a 50-50. I would even say it was like a 40-60 split of me not getting the cases, so... Just want to bear that in mind. Without further ado, let's go through the good deals. Kingdoms of Amalur, Ray Reckoning, 7 bucks. That's pretty ridiculous, honestly, off the top. Uh, you're not going to find that for $7 on a PSN sale or anything like that, so that's pretty great. What else? We got Death Stranding for $9. Again, when this goes on sale, I don't think it goes under like 19 bucks. So 9 bucks for that, I would say, is quite good. Resident Evil 2 is down to $8. When this goes on sale, it's usually 16 so... That's a pretty good deal as well. Outer Worlds, 9 bucks. Again, pretty good deal. Resident Evil 7 Biohazard, 6.49. I feel like when this goes on sale, if my memory recalls correctly, it's like 9.79. So again, a little bit of a decent uh, discount on that. South Park the Fractured But Whole is $5. I would say that that's pretty good. Dishonored 2, 7.49. Not a killer deal, but decent. LA Noir, 9.99. Again, that's not insane. But uh, physically, I would say that's a pretty good deal. Uh, Dragon Ball Fighters 949, that's like equivalent to when it's on a PSN sale. Still not bad. I would say that's pretty decent. Uh, Dragon Age Inquisition, 5 bucks. Ace Combat 7, Sky Zanone for $9 is really good. That is being added to PlayStation Now. Uh, so not a bad deal there. The Last Guardian, 949. Prey for 5 bucks is pretty insane. So I would definitely recommend Prey for $5. Uh, if you, again, buy five or more games. Tekken 7, 9 bucks. Not great, but I like Tekken 7, so I wanted to add that to my card. Borderlands, the Handsome Collection, 749 is excellent. This, I want to say, it's 10 to 15 on PSN when it goes on sale. So a little bit of a discount there uh, for Borderlands 2 and the pre-sequel, all the DLC. That's pretty good. Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor parody with the price on PSN most of the time is 5 bucks for that. Remnant from the Ashes. Now, this is going to be a PS Plus game this month, but... Just to illustrate, $9 for that is quite good. XCOM 2 for $5 is really good. Wolfenstein The New Order for 5 bucks is solid. Left Alive, which is not a very good game, but 5 bucks for that I thought was decent. New Gundam Breaker, $5. Destroy All Humans, 7 bucks for that, I would say, is really good. Final Fantasy XII, The Zodiac Age for 10 bucks. These Final Fantasy titles, some of them hold up in price, so 10 bucks for Zodiac Age is quite good. Mega Man Zero ZX Legacy Collection for $9. This is like $17.49 when it goes on sale on PSN, so $9 for this, I would say, is really good. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth is $9.99. Not a killer deal here, but... Decent enough. Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls Ultimate Evil Edition, $9.99. That's a really, really great deal. I mean, if you're looking for longevity out of your dollars spent, I would say that that's pretty solid. Omega Quintet, Niche JRPG, 9 bucks. Uh, honestly, never played that, so... Uh, okay, I have another copy of Wolfenstein New Order accidentally added to my cart. That is a whoopsie on me. I better remove that. Not like I'm making this order, just trying to illustrate prices for you guys. I probably will make some kind of order, though. Dark Pictures Man of Medan is down to 9.49. Wolfenstein 2, the New Colossus, is 9.99. Um... This actually doesn't have a savings attached to it, so that's a little bit strange. I don't know why that is. This should be five bucks. It's pre-owned, so yeah, I don't know what's up with that. Whatever. Uh, Dead Cells 749 for the physical edition is really good. That is an excellent deal for Dead Cells. Highly, highly recommended there. Uh, Desperados 3 is 9 bucks. That is a tremendous deal as well. Yakuza 6, The Song of Life is $9. Again, really good deal. Gravity Rush 2 is 10 bucks. That's been cheaper on PSN, mind you. That's been down to, like, I want to say $5.99 at, at its lowest. But if you want a physical copy, yeah, there you have it. $9.99 for that. The Surge 2, $7.49. Wolf Among Us is 9 bucks, which... That's been five bucks, but if you do want a physical copy, I thought, you know, it's a great game, so I wanted to give that a mention. Children of Morta, $7.49 for a physical copy. God Eater 3, nine bucks. Planescape Torment and Icewind Enhanced Edition, nine bucks for this is actually really good, and I'd give this a look. I think that's a tremendous deal. 
749 for Mega Man 11. I mean, I love the Blue Bomber, so I'm always going to recommend Mega Man. You got, you got ZX Legacy Collection on here. So Mega Man 11 for 749, I thought was solid. Onimisha Warlords for 999. Nothing crazy there. Dynasty Warriors 8 Empires for 999. Battle Chasers Night War for 5 bucks is really good. Banner Saga Trilogy for 649. Like, that is an awesome deal for all three Banner Saga games. That's quite good. Dark Souls Remaster for 949. This has surprisingly been holding up in price, so. I thought 949 for this was pretty good. Bulletstorm Full Clip Edition for 5 bucks. That's been on Plus before, but still, uh, if you missed out on it being on Plus, 5 bucks for that is quite good. Torment Tides of Numenera, 5 bucks. Uh, the Silver Case, 749. Dead or Alive 5 Last Round, 749. Uh, so yeah, that's essentially everything that I added to my cart. Like, that was me digging an hour through the, uh, what's it called? The the uh, $0 to $20 range because it's games $19.99 or less, and... Yeah, what you're going to see is, I wouldn't say all of these are like slam dunk home run great deals, but stuff like Wolfenstein New Order for 5 bucks, XCOM 2 for 5 bucks, Borderlands for $7.49, Prey for $5, uh, Ace Combat 7 for $9, what else? L.A. Noir for ten is decent. Dishonor two for seven forty nine. South Park for five bucks. Resident Evil seven for six forty nine. Outer Worlds for nine bucks. Uh, Resident Evil two for eight, and then Death Stranding for nine. That is tremendous. And then Kingdoms of Amalur: Ray Reckoning for seven bucks as well. When you're looking at all those deals, I think that's pretty good. Everything considered. So yeah, uh, something to note. Uh, there are a lot of new games on sale as well. Like I think there's a what was it, 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim is down to like $35, which is pretty good, but yeah, the pre-owned games is what really stuck out, out to me, and if you're the kind of guy that's looking to, you know, you know, pad out your backlog of PlayStation 4 titles and get all of those PlayStation 4 games that I would say are really good, and you know, really, uh, get those games and complete your ps4 library this is a pretty good way to do so and you're getting some games at a really low price uh destroy all humans for seven ff12 for t uh 10 and Mega Man zx legacy collection is quite good as well again there are a couple of other games that i saw i'll leave links to those in the description box below this is going to be something that i believe is going to be first come first serve some stuff is already going out of stock so i wanted to make this guy uh to make this video abundantly clear to you guys and so you can pick up what you want if you are interested but that's gonna wrap up this one again more links for other stuff will be in the description box below you have to buy five or more to get the 50 percent off discount but if you do that you get a pretty good deal and free shipping if you do uh i believe you have to spend x amount of dollars but you should be able to pass that no problem that's gonna wrap up this one sound off with all of your thoughts in the comment section down below thank you for watching and goodbye Hey guys, we hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, make sure to hit the subscribe button, and if you're already subscribed, do us a favor and hit the bell icon. This way you'll be notified whenever we post a new video. That's the best way to keep up with all of our uploads, and we usually try to upload two videos a day. And with the bell icon hit, you'll be notified whenever we do upload a video. As always, thanks for watching.